Hi, I'm Jim Pringle, head professional at the Sunshine Coast Golf and Country Club. It's one thing to have a great golf swing, but that's only half the battle in golf. Making good decisions and choosing the right club for every shot will make the game much easier. The biggest thing to learn is to understand the varying lies of the golf ball and the grass and which clubs are going to be most suited to play each shot. Fairway woods are great for long shots, but are best hit when the ball is lying up on top of the grass. A ball lying down deep in the rough just simply will be too difficult to have this club dig through the grass and get it out. So when my ball gets in a bad lie, I'm going to take my lumps, pull out my 7 iron or another lofted iron and make sure that I can move my ball towards the target even if it doesn't get me all the way to the green. Here's two lies of balls that are uh, quite a bit different. In this case you can see the ball is lying deep in the grass. My chances of getting my three wood and making great contact and getting this ball up in the air are very little. Here's a nice lie in the rough, quite the opposite. Easy for me to get that fairway wood uh, under the ball and launched up in the air and carrying a long distance. In fact, for a lot of players, a lie like this in the rough is uh, one of the easiest ones to hit a fairway wood. So in this situation, although I would have some distance to the green and want to get the ball all the way there, I would just make sure that I picked the appropriate club, something like a seven iron or lofted club, made a good swing, got it airborne, and moved down the fairway. So remember, Making great decisions on the golf course will save you strokes. If you have any other questions about course management or any other questions about your golf game, contact the professional staff at the Sunshine Coast Golf and Country Club.